today I, for the first time in like forever, actually have the book that I'm going to be reviewing. It's called Then I Met My Sister. You can't really see the title because it's really tiny. There we go. There it is. And this... I'm so excited for this because I read this in um, less than 24 hours. Like, look at this. It's not very big, but still. So, that is that is a good book right there. Um, I got it on Wednesday night at like 7, like 8 o'clock. And I finished it Thursday at like 2 o'clock. I, yeah, I read during school because I'm just a nerd. But, anyways... Um, I love this book. It was so good. Um, it's about a girl named Summer, and she is going to be a senior in high school, and she has this older sister that, um, died before she was born. Um, her sister died when she was 17. The summer, the, she was, her older sister Shannon was driving to school on the first day of her freshman year, or on of her senior year of high school, and she ran into a tree and she died in her car. She she um, was in a car accident, and so that's why Summer was born to basically like fill her sister's place um, in her parents' heart, and um, she's known that all her life, um, and uh, so, and Shannon, her older sister, who's dead was, um, she was, like, perfect in every way. Her parents made her out to be, like, really perfect because she had good grades. She was, like, a cheerleader, and, um, she basically just seemed perfect to Summer. Um, and then the summer before her senior year, Summer gets, um, Summer gets the journal that her older sister kept, um, the summer before she died. And so... Uh, Summer starts reading the journal, and she learns a lot about her sister, and she learns a lot about her family um, that she really didn't expect, um, and so it's just, she's really interesting, and um, I don't know, it just wasn't really your typical book, I guess you could say. There is a little bit of romance in it um, with uh, Summer's best friend, Gibbs. That's his name. It's a weird name. But, um, so there's some romance there. And there's a lot of, like, family tension, um, that, that Summer thinks is there because, um, Shannon died. But really, when she reads Shannon's journal, she realizes that, um, her sister went through the same things that she is going through now. So, it's... I don't know, it's it's kind of, I don't want to give away too much, but there are a lot of twists um, in the book, which I liked. Like, there's one at the end where you're like, oh, hmm, that's interesting. Um, and so it's, I would say this is a sad book, but I mean, I didn't cry or anything. I didn't, like, I didn't get super upset, but I mean, the fact that her sister did die is very sad, and um, there are some emotional parts of the book, but it's not like a tearjerker or anything, so yeah, I don't know, I just, I just really recommend this book. It's not very long, it's, and the print, it's pretty big print, so... Yeah, it's a quick book, obviously, since I read it, like, really quick. Um, and, yeah, I, because I went on a um, book haul, if you will, <laughs> and I went to Barnes & Noble, and I got a lot of books last night um, that I'm really excited about reading and zipping through them. So, yeah, be looking out for those. And I hope you guys are having a good rest of the day. I'll see you guys later.